do the vlog. Just got ready and then I'm me and Kaysen are gonna go to Ross and then Walmart because I want to start doing like Christmas shopping. So I was gonna do that and then I'll do like some sort of haul because I've never done a haul before. I'm hoping in the next month I can invest into a vlog camera so that my quality changes because I know quality is important for an accessible YouTube channel. So just hang tight with me with the quality. I promise it'll get better. Um, but yeah, so I'm going to go ahead and go do that. I'll look at vlog cameras and maybe I can ha keep some in mind so that when I have the money to invest into one, I know exactly which one that I want to be investing in. I have a few that are in mind. Um, I was thinking of the Canon PowerShot, the one, not the cheap one, like the one that, the one that has like a viewfinder that you can flip up so that I can see myself because vlogging without being able to see yourself would be really hard. And then I think that's the only one I have in mind for now, but if there is a cheaper one that does something similar, then I'll most likely be investing into that. I'm just really wanting quality and I want one that has Wi-Fi so that I can transport it to my phone to be edited because I do not have a computer at the moment. I have one, but it's a 2009 Mac. Very slow, so I don't know if it'll have the capabilities of a newer Mac, so probably eventually buy a used Mac just because you can get them online used for a lot cheaper, but yeah. That's what I'm going to be doing today. Alright, so I'm going to get case in. Um, it worked today, and then I'm going to go get him, and then I'm probably going to go to Ross, um, and because I work there, so I get a discount, which is really awesome. It's 20%, um, so which is pretty good because it's already cheap stuff, so a discount on cheap stuff is a win. So that's what I'm going to go do. Yes, so I'll see you guys soon. Okay, so I'm back from Ross. I'm about to feed Kaysen and then everything done that I usually do in his nightly routine. And then I will do a little haul of what I got him. I got him a lot of Christmas gifts and then I got myself a few sweaters. So I'm gonna go feed him and then I'll be right back. something or racking this especially on hard floor so they fall backwards they get hurt mm -hmm. so okay okay so these are the pajamas i picked out for him these have little dragons on them this was his dragon out bedtime that is very true with him he does not sleep <laughs> what are you doing what are you doing? Oh, you found a hobby. Throwing out all your clothes. <laughs> what are you doing? So today's vlog kind of sucks. Um, there isn't really much going on besides going to Ross. So I'm going to do that haul today. It's not really going to be a, <gasps> be like a really big haul. But it'll be a pretty decent one. Oh my god, um, a few big things. Like, I'll have to show you guys when I get a chance. Probably when I go downstairs. But, I'm st we're still not done. Um, his dad's still gonna get a few things because I told him he has to help me. <laughs> Can't do it all on my own. But, he's found some DVDs. Spongebob. And, holiday trolls. <laughs> I guess those are some, some stuff he's interested in watching. <laughs> this is what Kaysen is currently up to. We're wondering what room we're in where my sister's in. I think I've seen the previous video, so it's a lot cleaner than it was. But yeah, so yeah. It's 
pulling the stand on everything in the bed. He's trying to pull the stand on there. And that's probably what he's going to do right now. Yep. He's not really standing yet, but he is pulling up. And he walks with his knees. So you will do it. Walk with your knees. Walk with your knees. So he didn't sit up till eight months. And then he didn't crawl. Like he started showing signs of crawling in nine months. And then he officially crawled at 10 months. So, and then shortly after he started doing this. So probably have a stander or a walker in a few months, but he does turn one year next month in December. So he's, he was kind of behind for a while and then all of a sudden you just caught up. So which makes me really happy. See, there he goes. Yeah, see. It makes me really happy because I was concerned. I wasn't able to really enjoy his babyhood as much because I was just so concerned because, like, if you can tell, he has plagiocephaly. Um, it used to be way worse than this. He did have three helmets. Like, it used to be very flat. And no, it is not my fault. So what causes it is corticollis. It's when their neck gets, like, stiff. It like so they're always turning to one side all the time and so when he was first born i noticed his head was always turned to one side and i tried exercises um i tried doing tummy time i tried having him sleep on his side on naps during naps and i was always by his side and leave him like that by himself but i just tried doing all that wasn't working and so at three months he went in got evaluated and got a helmet and it was not a fun experience um he was always sweaty hot he was crying every time it was on when he was doing tummy time, he'd get so mad and put his head down and didn't lift it because he just hated it. And so, after the third helmet, we just are just going to let it go. It does, it can naturally go back to normal once they start walking and crawling and sitting and everything. So that's what he's been doing. Um, He does sleep on his stomach when he's in his back and play. So yeah. Mama. And so, it, I have, it has improved a lot. Even without... Anyways, so, yeah, since he... I have seen... A lot of improvement even after the three helmets but if your kid does have a flat like a really bad flat spot or just a flat spot that's noticeable i do suggest trying a helmet there is natural treatment groups on facebook and that's what i've been following ever since he's been out of his third helmet so we're seeing great progress huh yeah mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah hey my kid Good morning guys, it is the next day, it is 5am and I am awake, um, I don't work till 7 but Kason woke up at 4, um, he did go back to sleep so I got ready, I still have to get dressed and do my hair but, um, I didn't get a chance to finish the vlog yesterday because, I don't know, Kason was being kind of ornery, I think he's teething so I went downstairs, tried to attempt to put him to sleep, it was a it was a long process and then I finally got him to sleep and then he woke up like two hours later and he would not go back to sleep and so I had to bring him in my bed, lay with him, we fell asleep, he woke up at four. I don't do this often so please don't attack me. I don't go to sleep often. And then we came up here, he's currently in here in my sister's room and he's asleep. Um, you know, I have to wake him up at about 5.30. Anyway, it makes me feel bad when I have to wake him up. It's just what I gotta do. So, yeah, after I do all that, um, I'll see you guys a little bit later today. I'll be doing the Ross haul that I said I was gonna do yesterday. Um, it's not a big haul, but I'll, I just wanna show you guys what I got because it's really cute stuff. And it might be, like, it'll give you some ideas maybe for your child if they're gonna be one. Hi guys, welcome back to the vlog. So I just got off work, so I'm gonna go to Walmart real quick because I wanted to see if I could find a tripod so that when I film video it's easier than having to find something to set my phone up on. So yeah, and then I'm gonna try to find one that's for cameras and phones if that's possible. So if I do end up getting a camera, I don't have to buy a whole other tripod. So yeah, and I'm just gonna quickly head to Walmart real quick and I will see you guys when I get there. All right, so I made it to Walmart. I'm gonna go inside real quick and see if I can find a tripod. And if not, then I don't know. <laughs> I guess I'll have to order one, but I just thought I'd check stores around me first before I happen to order one. So 
Okay, so I found the tripod. I'm gonna go home and do my little Ross haul and then I'll do my, uh, show you what I got from Walmart. I got some something for Kaysen as well that's really cute. Ignore my makeup, my mask did that. I wear it work away, so yeah. I'll see you guys when I get home. Okay, so I'm gonna do a quick clean up of my room. Then I will show you guys what I got from Ross yesterday for Kaysen's Christmas and then I will unbox the tripod. Oh my gosh, my makeup looks so bad because of my mask, ruined it. Tried to fix it, but it didn't really work. So here is what I got from Ross yesterday for Kaysen's Christmas. I got the Kids Works Ton of Blocks Big Wagon. It comes with 25 pieces. And then this is like the front of it. Um, he already has um, Mega Blocks, so I think this would be really cool. I think he would enjoy it because I hope by, it says one and up. So if you have a one year old boy, I definitely recommend this. Um, let's see, it was $11.99 at Ross, so really good deal versus like seeing it for 40 bucks at Walmart. So $11.99 is definitely a good deal. And then I got him this little kitchen. I used to work at a daycare and they had a ton of these in the one to three year old room. There, It's a very short kitchen. So it's something for, that's great for a one year old because I feel like they, they will enjoy it. It's their size. So those big giant kitchens, I think this is great. And since I still live with my parents for right now, um, this would be great because it won't take up a lot of space since there's not a lot of space. It does say three and up, but I don't think it really matters because all the parts are big anyway. Um, so it's called Cooking Time Modern Electronic Kitchen. So yeah, that is the second thing I've gotten him so far. And then, oh, and that was $14.99 at Ross. So it was a really good deal. And then I also got him some bath toys. But this best was only $5.99. It comes with a ton of bath toys and he loves the little toys. Like he has a few ducks and stuff. So I think he'll really enjoy that. And then I got a few other things. Well, not really for Christmas, but I got myself some things. Oh, and then these are also Kaysen's. Some little Converse socks because he's growing out of his socks. And they were $3.99. So really good deal. And then I got myself this little graphic butterfly shirt graphic butterfly shirt kind of straightening out says Mar mariposa i don't really know what that means but and it was 9.99 and then i got this shirt this little cheetah print shirt yesterday as well from ross um i love it i'm really loving this print i'm seeing it a lot more nowadays so i wanted to get one for myself so it's pretty cute okay and then you know i you guys know i just barely went to walmart but I couldn't resist these holiday pajamas. They were only $4, $4.95 or something like that. Yes, see, $4.96. So I will link these in the description if I can find them on the Walmart website. I will definitely link them in the description. And then here is the tripod. It is the multi-pod six-in-one tripod. Uh, 360 ball head, rechargeable wireless shutter remote, extends from seven inches to 36 inches for smartphones cameras and gopros so if i get a camera i can use this for that as well and if you can see if it'll focus kind of really want to get a camera because the quality is not great see it it shows like the extent and then it says multi-angle shooting 90 degree vertical shooting smartphone mount gopro mount tabletop tripod desktop tripod selfie stick function 
What's in the box? Multipod, phone tripod, GoPro, wireless shutter remote, micro USB. Okay, so let's go ahead and open this up. it opened it comes with it looks like an adapter for a camera and then I think this is a I don't know which piece is what but it comes with this part I'm sure these are all screw on parts for the camera and GoPro and then here is the phone mount so you screw that on as well and then here is the actual tripod thing Oh, it's really loose. It's pressy, you can adjust it. Okay. So here's the, yeah, this is actually pretty nice. I got this for $16. Like I'm, if you press this, it takes a photo. I'm pretty impressed actually. So it looks like you open it up. Like open it like this. Put that back. Then it also comes with a micro USB. I think it's to charge it, is it because it's battery powered or something? Okay, so this is what it all came with. So I can't wait to start using this. I was gonna film a sit down video today, but I don't know if I'll have the time to because my phone's dying. But if I decide to, I will definitely be using this. So yeah. Yep. Okay, so thanks so much for watching the vlog. Um, I'm gonna end the vlog here. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed the content from last night and then today me unboxing and the hauls and everything. So if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and hit the bell icon to be notified every time I upload a video and I will see you guys next time.